So, what's new in DO 3.1? After testing it, the improvements are genuinely impressive. We're seeing enhanced realism, better motion, and a significant leap in the ability to maintain continuity. But the real stars of the show, in my opinion, are these three. One, ingredients, your new best friend for consistency. Two, insert, seamlessly insert new elements into your scenes. Three, extend, create longer video that continues the action seamlessly from the previous clip. In this video, I'll walk you through all three new features in Google Flow. Let's talk about ingredient. First, we'll choose the ingredient feature. Next, we can upload the image generated elsewhere, or we can generate one right here in Flow. I'll use this image I generated earlier. Let's type in a simple prompt and choose 3.1 quality or fast. I'll use fast for this one. It'll take less than two minutes. That's the same woman, no doubt. Now, we'll add another man to generate two consistent characters. I'll use a long prompt for this one. The research data is out. It does not look good. We cannot tell anyone. Not too bad. Let's see if we can add an object and location. The same woman, a Harley Davidson, and a ruined city street. All three ingredients are consistent, but the style leans a little toward animation. Okay, now let's do the extend feature. First, we'll generate a clip using the same woman and a different location. Type in the prompt. Hello. Click Add to Scene to go to Scene Builder. Click on the video we want to extend, and then click Extend. We can also select Jump To if you want to cut to a different scene instead of the continuation of the previous video, but we won't touch on that today. Now type in the prompt. The woman answers the phone, then alarm suddenly goes off, and she walks out the door. I'll use 3.1 quality. Unit 7, we have a breach. Repeat, we have a breach. <sighs> we'll extend it again. Now a zombie comes out from a door. I did reroll a few times for this scene. As you can see, the woman looks a little different at the end. So for now, this is the extend features limitation. So what about the voice? Can it stays consistent? Let's watch a few videos I generated with the same woman. Progressive atrophy detected. This is serious, sir. I'd like a large pumpkin spice latte, extra shot of espresso, lots of whipped cream. Thanks. Within four hours, heightened aggression, compulsive feeding behaviors. Within 12 hours, degradation of higher cortical regions, preservation of motor Well, function. the voice sounds pretty close for all three, and the lip sync is perfect. I mentioned in my previous video that if we use the same character within the same project in Google Flow, the voice will usually stay consistent. So what else is the ingredient feature capable of? We can use ingredient as style reference. I'll take this Pixar style image and the man as character. Type in this prompt, use ingredient one, as style and location reference. Use ingredient two as character reference. The man walking his white dog in the suburban neighborhood. This one is an anime style, using a blonde woman as character and the same prompt format. Now, let's look at the new insert feature. First, we'll generate a video, a woman walking down an empty city street. I'm not sure why the street is so empty. It's usually bustling this time of day. Click the pencil icon here, then type in what we want to add. I'll add a red bus on the street. I'm not sure why the street is so empty. It's usually bustling this time of day. An explosion. I'm not sure Notice the insert so feature empty. doesn't create different sound effects, it's like an explosion. Bustling this time of day. A tiger. I'm not sure why the street is so empty. Look at the shadow of the tiger. It's usually bustling this time of day. Hello, we can also everyone. add more people. Welcome back to the show. Today, we will announce the winner. I told Even you add I text that. on the wall. See how natural it looks. For a long time, right, one of the biggest challenges in AI video generation has been maintaining consistency. You generate one clip with a great character, but then try to generate another clip with the same character. 
and you'd end up with something subtly or even drastically different. VO 3.1's ingredient feature completely solves this. And there you have it. VO 3.1 is a monumental leap forward in AI video generation. The ingredient feature alone is worth the upgrade, providing the much needed consistency for serious storytelling and branding. Coupled with the flexibility of insert and extend, your creative workflow is about to become significantly more powerful and efficient. What are you most excited to try in VO 3.1? Or if you have any questions, let me know in the comments you below. Told me Thanks for watching.